What up, y'all? This is the last video of the night, of the day, or whatever, whatever you want to call it. But uh, yeah, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Casey Jones, Nickelodeon Super 7 Ultimates. So, dude, this is, this is going to be awesome sauce because I love Casey Jones. Everybody loves Casey Jones. He's like a fan favorite, man, for sure. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, bust this guy out, check him out. Once again, we got the cool slip case with the manhole cover. It's pretty awesome. Let's go ahead and check him out. Oh, rad, dude. Cool, man. He seems a lot taller than I thought he was going to be. That's cool, man. That's rad. He comes with mad accessories, dude. You got the vintage ones and like the sprue kit or whatever, the sprue tree, and painted versions of those. So that's awesome. Let's go ahead and uh, check out the back of the box. Casey Jones, the battering vigilante sportsman. Like all psychos, Casey Jones, the mass sportsman, wanted to be a legend, armed with broken bats, shattered dreams, and one golf club. <laughs> Casey turned his ambition towards crime fighting, modeling himself after his favorite vigilante, uh, vigilante cop show. Let's see. Casey decided to take the law into his own mitts, outfitted with cast off sports gear. Casey challenges every criminal who dares to go out of bounds, teaming up with our beloved Turtle Teens. Casey strikes out with a special vengeance against Shredder and the Foot Clan. Rad, dude. That is sick, man. That's going to be cool. Rad. Yeah, let's go ahead and uh, bust him out, man. Woo. And here's the man himself, folks, Casey Jones. Man, he comes with so much crap. It's insane. These figures really just, man, it's, it's nuts. Here's this cool little golf bag. They really did good detail with this. The zippers and stuff little buttons and all that man that's pretty cool it's not bad that's pretty rad he's got his bats busted bats that's pretty rad dude that's cool and like you get the vintage looking versions on the little sprue uh sprue tree or sprue kit or whatever and then you get a uh, the painted versions which are rad because they added like made them look dingy and dirty and all beat up so that's pretty cool and you get hockey pucks Little hockey pucks that's cool man all taped up got six hands so that's cool bandaged other bandaged hands and stuff with paint apps on them and the glove hands so that's cool and it's like a hockey goal man that's cool or like a little soccer goal or whatever, practice goal. That's rad. That is really cool, man. Yeah, they did excellent job with these, dude. That's cool. Waist twisty. Once again, splits. So you got that cool cut right there. You got knees. Got the rocker pivot thing going with the swivel, so that's cool. It's pretty rad, man. But once again, you know, it's kind of funny. He's such a cool character. And like even back in the day, it's like, man, Casey Jones, he's rad. But um, he's wearing like some straight up soccer mom gear. Like <laughs> total Karen gear, man, with like a lavender sweatpants and like a turquoise, you know, cut off hoodie, like <laughs> cut off with the midriff, man. It's kind of questionable. <laughs> it really is. It's funny, man. It really is. But yeah, let's go ahead and, um, yeah, we're gonna have to bust him out and pose the hockey mask. It's rad. This is really cool. Even the hair sculpt is awesome. That is so rad. Very, very awesome. Really, really good details. And here he is, folks, ready to do some battle with the turtles, man. Or battle alongside them against the Foot Clan. In the sewers or in the streets. Anywhere, man. <laughs> this is a really cool figure, man. He's, he's not bad. Um, would I say he's my favorite out of all of them so far? Um, he's one of my favorite characters. I like him a lot. I like him a lot. But, man, I think for the win, it's going to be hard to say who's, who's going to get the win. Because I really like the fact that you can make Mondo Gecko do a hand plant. That's really cool. Donatello is one of my favorites of all time, too. I love him as far as turtles go. Like, favorite turtles. He's my favorite turtle. Um, dude, Muckman's like an insanely huge figure. It's, it's like really hard to 
say which one's the best, man. It's it's it really is. Ooh, man, they're they're all really cool. But Casey's rad. There's a there seem his legs seem a little loosey goosey. Um, we'll see if we can get him in another pose or something. But um, his legs seem a little loose. Other than that, these are just really cool figures. Um, they are lacking like ab crunch and stuff like that. But for being Ninja Turtle figures, man, I don't. They probably don't really need it. You know, yeah, they probably really don't need it at all. But um, other than that, man, they're they're pretty neat, man. They they do what they need to do, man, without having like way too many cuts or crazy double elbows or a lot of other stuff. So it it really 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 works. And this is proof in the pudding that you can get them in a kicking stance, so that's cool. You can balance them on one foot. So this figure is well balanced once again. And um, yeah, man, he's a little loosey goosey in the legs a little bit. It's not too bad, but. Hey, you get him to kick, man. So that's cool. That makes for good uh, pictures and stuff and poses and just fun, man. Really, really fun. Well, man, that's a look at Casey Jones. I, I like him a lot. Now for the end of the video, we're gonna I'm gonna go ahead and bust out all the figures and we'll just check them out all together. Really, really awesome, man. And well, folks, that's it for our look at the Wave Four Ultimates uh, Ninja Turtle figures, man. These are these are really rad, dude. They're really, really cool, man. Super Seven's just knocking it out of the park, man. And, who knows what else they'll do in the next couple years with, um, or the, even this year with uh, Ultimates, man. They're just really knocking out of the park, and I'm real tempted to check out other Ultimates, especially from previous Turtle Waves, because this is Wave 4, so they have three other waves besides this that are pretty awesome. But yeah, once again, thanks for everybody for tuning in uh, and uh, putting up with these videos today. They're, oh, these figures are awesome. Uh, Man, the pecking order, I would say, yeah, it's hard to say, man, because they're all really good figures. <laughs> they're all really cool. I like Mondo Gecko a lot. Muckman's awesome. He's huge. He's the Hulk of a figure. Donatello looks rad. He's, like I said, one. he's like my favorite top turtles. Uh, Casey's rad, but I feel like he's got little issues with his legs a bit. You know, probably have to work with them a bit. Other than that, he still looks pretty awesome, pretty menacing, pretty intimidating. But yeah, once again, thanks for everybody for tuning in and let me know what you think, which is your favorite out of all these. And um, yeah, hopefully more reviews and stuff coming up soon. All right, later y'all. Peace.